Hi, Neil here from Neil Brown Reviews. Today we're going to have a look at the McAfee Internet Security, what it offers for an iPhone. So here we have an iPhone 7 Plus with the email from McAfee giving me a link to the mobile protection site. And also if I wanted to download on Windows or OS X. We'll go to the mobile protection and so it gives us an activation code. There's also TrueKey by Intel Security. However, I already used the LastPass password system, so I won't be using the TrueKey system. So clicking on Download takes us to McAfee Mobile Security site, which then takes us to the store. And you can see screenshots, McAfee, McAfee Mobile Security gives us a shot of a media vault, contacts backup, and a find device features. Shows us an example of backing up photos with the McAfee vault. And also shows that if someone tries to decode the vault password, then they take a snapshot of the person. No reviews currently. And we note that it offers an Apple Watch app as well. Click install. So it's installed and ready to open open it. Welcome screen. By clicking get started I accept the license agreement privacy notice. License agreement is here and there is a privacy notice as well. So a privacy notice with a number of subsections available for us to review. Come back to the welcome screen. We'll go to the get started. It's beginning to set things up. It's confirming the username which is a email address. We'll continue with that. We'll allow it to send notifications because it might be telling us something important about risks we're facing. It says our account set up and gives us the option to click start. So the alerts it's giving us is that the find device is off because it needs to have location services turned on to locate us. For the purpose of this, we'll turn it on. We'll allow it to use we can protect our contacts by backing them up. Of course, you should have other iPhone backups, but we'll back them up as well. Let them access security. So now it's fully backed up our contacts. <coughs> Gives us a date of the backup and we'll activate auto backing up of contacts. Back to the main screen. Now, SOS is saving the device location when your battery is low. So if you've lost your device and the battery is run down, then it will have saved the location of the device just before the battery runs down. So we'll turn that on. Now it offers to set up our vault. I'll put in some password. Just putting in 123456, but obviously you choose a more secure one. Now we'll have a look what we, when we click Media Vault. Enter our PIN. <coughs> Gives us the option to add photos to our vault. So practice with a letting our camera take a shot of my MacBook. Use that photo. Try the PIN again. Now it shows us <coughs> it shows us the protected photo. Little lock up there shows it's protected. Any options here? Options to protect more devices, let someone else know about the app, rating, feedback, gives a version number, gives you access to license agreement and privacy notice again. So in summary, that's the McAfee security for mobile devices with a media vault, contacts backup, and a find device option. So I hope you liked seeing what McAfee actually offers on an iOS device, and take that into account when you're considering what internet security system you'll get for your protection of all your devices. So thank you for listening. If you've enjoyed this, click subscribe, and also click on the little notification bell, and that'll make sure that you hear about all the new videos that we produce in the computer security area. Thank you.